In this video, I'm going to show you how to do a skull effect in Final Cut Pro. No plugins, completely for free. Hope you guys enjoy this video. Okay, so this is the skull effect. So it's probably better to do this on a tripod, but I just got this video from pexels.com. And it, there's not a whole lot of movement right here. Um, but we'll have to mask a little bit, but I'll go ahead and start right here. So let's go ahead and command B and cut that clip right there. And then our effect will stop. Let's see. 30 seconds. That's fine. About two seconds. We'll do the effect for. <clears throat> so what you want to do is go to Google and find a an image of of a skull okay so you want to grab your skull here we go you can do an arm a leg doesn't matter but in this case we're gonna do the skull and you want to come down here to where it says blend mode you want to change that to screen and then we are going to transform. Let's, whoops. There we go. Okay, we're going to make it. Do about that size. And then we're going to rotate it. Fit his head. About right there. Okay. So let's start from the very beginning and we're going to add a keyframe right here. And then we're just going to use our right arrow key to just arrow over frame by frame. And if the image goes off his face, then we'll have to adjust. It's coming off a little bit. Just adjust that a tad bit. Keep going. up a little bit all right to the left come down a bit all right we're almost there and okay, there we go. Okay, we'll hit done on that. So when you play that back, it should be lined up pretty good. Whoops. Play it back and okay, that's good. So now what we want to do is let's go ahead and zoom in a little bit. Okay. Okay, so let's go ahead and just frame over one keyframe. Just do one at a time. Whoops. God dang it. Just on the top clip for right now. That's what I'm trying to do. Alright, and then we'll skip a couple frames. go all over the place here okay then what we want to do is go down to effects and we want x-ray put that on the on the bottom clip okay then what we want to do is 
that's where we started. We're gonna go every other clip and we're gonna hit V to disable the clip. Just do every other clip. Okay, we'll leave those two, that's fine. And then, for the bottom clip, we'll just do every like 10 frames or so. Okay, that should be fine. And then, So for this, so the first one we got the effect right there, the x-ray effect. Second frame we'll take it out, and then third frame we'll bring it back. Fourth one, and we'll take it away. So when we run that back it should look something like this. And the x-ray is a little harsh. We can take we can bring it down a little bit. Okay, we'll adjust that a little bit. Okay, let me run that back. Go ahead and cancel that. Okay, should look better. 